when a winemaker orders a barrel, they'll order, you know, the shape of the barrel, Burgundy, Bordeaux, a little bit different shapes. They'll order, you know, where the wood is from France, how long it's been air dried, and then what toast level they want on the barrel and on the heads. So everything we do, we do is custom made for each winemaker. Bringing the people behind our food to life. So I grew up in Shoals next to Ponzi Vineyard and started working in the vineyard and then in the winery um, while I was going to school at Oregon State studying forest engineering and uh, kind of had this idea of putting the two together. In 1992, I decided to go to Europe. This is what we're starting with. I made arrangements to visit a couple of cooperages in Burgundy and uh, one that I visited, Francois Frere. Basically, uh, after the tour, we started talking and they found out I was a forester. They were like, oh, we're buying some logs tomorrow. Do you want to come back and, and go with the guy buying some logs? That turned into about a year and a half internship where I worked at the Cooperage and kind of went through the whole process. What we're trying to do is really match that winemaking style and vineyard to uh, the toast of the barrel, or where the wood's coming from. And what works for one winemaker may not work for another winemaker. So there's a, it's, it's pretty subjective what, you know, uh, what makes a good barrel. It's kind of knowing that winemaker style, knowing what kind of fruit he's working with, uh, and also the vintage, knowing uh, you know, what the vintage is gonna be like. So yeah, there's definitely a, you know, a strong relationship between what we're doing here and the winemakers, and we work really close with them trying to get what they want you know, as far as out of the barrel.